As we explained earlier, registrars must take reasonable steps to investigate and correct reports of inaccurate WHOIS data. These reports might come to a registrar directly from an Internet user or from ICANN through its WHOIS Inaccuracy Complaint Form. The WHOIS Inaccuracy Complaint Form allows Internet users to submit reports to ICANN accredited registrars concerning incomplete or inaccurate WHOIS data through a form on ICANN's website. ICANN evaluates each report submitted to ensure that it appears to be valid. Reports about domains that no longer exist, are pending deletion, or have been suspended or placed on a hold status are deemed invalid, and the system notifies the reporter that the report has been rejected. Valid WHOIS data problem reports are transmitted by email to the applicable registrars for investigation. ICANN's compliance staff monitors registrar responses and reporter verifications and sends inquiry notices to registrars who do not submit follow-up responses. The inquiry notice may require the registrar to provide documentation to prove that it handled the complaint appropriately. Failure to respond to such an inquiry notice is a breach of the RAA and could result in termination of the registrar's accreditation if not cured. The Who Is Inaccuracy Complaint Form is an important tool that allows all Internet users to help promote and maintain Who Is data accuracy. Registrar participation and cooperation in this process is critical to ensuring that Who Is Inaccuracy reports are timely and appropriately handled. ICANN's compliance staff has continually adapted and evolved the system as a result of both registrar and community feedback and encourages you to report any issues you experience or suggestions you may have for possible improvement. We mentioned earlier that registrars may sometimes have to cancel registrations due to inaccurate WHOIS data. When that happens, the registrant may ask the registrar to redeem its deleted domain name. The Restored Names Accuracy Policy addresses this situation. In particular, if a domain name is deleted due to inaccurate WHOIS data or non-response to registrar inquiries and then is redeemed by the registrant during the registration's redemption grace period, the sponsoring registrar must place the registration on client hold status until the registrant has provided updated and accurate WHOIS information.